Saucy. I am the man who is bringing you the Animal Crossing, and you're going to have to like it. Well, you don't have to. You can do whatever you want if you like it. That's really nice. Thank you. If you don't like it, please, please let me know in the comments. I'm so excited to hear all about how people don't like my show. It's very... I'm on the edge of my seat with excitement to see what the people think. I'm sure... Although if you do like it, you can also write that in the comments too. We have a special offer there to send to the table. There's always a reward for anyone who earns it too. It's the pay. We have something here. What is this? Oh, Red Vase. Remember we were taking milkshakes out of it? Oh, boy. Well, let's actually have a look at the Red Vase in action. Let's take a little snapshot, shall we? Wow. It's so red. My goodness. Let me see. It's actually nice. You know what? I'm not going to make fun of it. I think I'll keep the vase. The vase. I think I'll keep the vase. It's mine now. Is it from the museum? I can tell you either way. The museum very kindly sent me dinosaur bones. Did you know, kids, if you write to the museum and just say, you got any dinosaur bones? They'll reply and give you dinosaur bones. It's the law. They can't say no to that. They have to give you the dinosaur bones. What's this? A grass model. I think I have that. But let's go back to the house. And have a look. Go have a look. Yeah. I think I have a bunch of models. I have most of the models, I think. Let me look. Yep, it's a little patch of grass, and let me see. I think the rest of them might be down the stairs. Let me just stick the light on. There's a tree and a tree. Is that grass? I don't know. What is this one? I'm stepping on it. I would, oh no, maybe it's not grass. Maybe it's like a, a patch of dirt. Yeah. Yeah, boy. Well, maybe we'll put the grass patch right here. Perfect. I'm making my own little, little patch. It's amazing. It's going to be so pretty. I mean, I'm not obviously not doing that at all. I'm not doing that. I'm not. You can't make me. Let's see. We got some dino bones. All right. Let's go talk to Tom Newt. They're the same. Nobody moved in, have they? Except for that, like, nobody's, nobody's gonna freak me out by just appearing like some kind of ghoul. Because if there's one thing I don't like, it's ghouls. They're ghoulish. They're not fair. You try to go about your business and then suddenly there's a big ghoul in your face. Hi, Mitzi. I'm just having a nice stroll to stay in shape. Business is important. Ain't that the truth. What's up, Mitzi? Have you ever run into Gracie? I hear she drives a beautiful sports car and gives fashion advice to everyone she meets. The thing is, you can't just buy her clothes, you have to earn them. So that makes me think Gracie might be around the corner somewhere. Hoorah. Hoorah. Alright, where is Gracie? Is this Gracie? Is Gracie a ghoul? Can't stand ghouls, I just can't. It's too much for me. Knock yourself out. I will. Have you, have you gotten fatter? Yes. I thought so. You just gotta watch your snack intake, especially this time of day. Eating snacks now is like a first class one way ticket to pork them. I have my way with my clothes, so isn't it? Whatever. Look, man, I don't want people bringing attention to the fact that I'm a super overweight obese man. I don't need that in my life. Yeah, I weigh 600 pounds, so what? What else? What? It's not important. I'll, I'll persevere, you know? It's fine. I, it's not like my parents have to get me out of bed by sticking an oar underneath me and like using it as a wedge and like flipping me over. It doesn't happen. Oh, we got this, didn't we? Strange painting. You know what? It's a strange painting. I'm pretty sure we already have it. So we'll check the museum. But I want it anyway. I want it for me. Nobody else can have it. It's mine. You're going to lose this ticket? 
Come through here. Good. That was a close one. Good thing I did that. Um, so yes, yeah, so if you can hear me on the camera uh, wheezing for my, my, my life, that's simply because I'm an overweight 600 pound man. And I have no regrets. Not at all. You know, I'd do it again. People say, you're super fat. And I'm like, yeah, but think about the cakes I ate. Four, maybe five cakes. You know, all by myself. I did this. I ate all the cakes. You can't, you can't buy that kind of class. I'm a cake eating machine. Not literally. They haven't made a machine that eats cakes. I guess a cake eating machine is like a human. You know, you say you eat cakes. Let me know what you eat. Just saying. Just saying. Think about it. I don't know what that means. Um, yeah, so you know. I got some fines. I'm not talking about money. <laughs> but imagine if I actually had 600 fines in money. The things I would buy. For example, more cakes. That's exactly what I would do. Oh, I forgot to sell my dino bones. I'll do that now. I will go back. Maybe I can make my 600 pounds this way. Oh, they call them bells. So that's fine. Um, I'd like to sell. Would you buy 500 pounds of fat? We can just scrape it off me. Is 100 pounds a good weight for a, an adult man? I don't know. Like, what's the, the, what's the appropriate weight? Because I don't know if 100 pounds is appropriate, but I suspect. I suspect that the 800 pounds is also not appropriate. So I'm asking you, where's the middleman? How do I figure it out? It's too hard. Too many numbers. I can't. How am I supposed to know what the optimum w w weight number is? Is there a website that tells me? Possibly. Have I looked at that website? No, I just didn't know it existed. I was trying to hypotheticalize it right now while I was doing the show. So that's the only time I've ever thought about it. So how could I look it up? I didn't even know it existed. Think about stuff before you you say anything. Do you have time to wander around aimlessly? Do you have time to clean? Very interesting. I bet your room is full of junk. That's so yucky. You're yucky. I'm gonna talk to you instead. <laughs> Hello. Boy, howdy, Explorer. You're looking like a picture of hell. Even though I'm 600 pounds, it's difficult. Dude, there's this giraffe chick who comes here every now and then. I hear she gives you clothes. No, that's not it. You gotta win some games or something? What was your name again? Grape Juice. No, that's not it. Who cares about names anyway? I'm good at names. I'm good at games, but I stink at names. I don't care about clothes, but I want to compete against her. I know I could win that game. Are you okay, dude? Have you got, like, issues? You seem a little... You seem a little on edge there, Sonny. Maybe you want to calm down and eat some spaghetti. It always makes me feel better, even if it's spaghetti. There it is. So we already have this. That's neat. That means I can put it in my house. My house is covered in junk, according to that mouse. But what does she know? Where's her house? Oh, let's go into her house. That's an excellent idea I just had. Then I'll eat all our food. And she's like, how'd you get in my house? And I'm like, through the door. But of course, no doorway can can accommodate me, a 600 pound man. She has two beds. And a toilet right beside, so you can have a look at the people sleeping while you're taking a dump. What a great idea. You know, I'm sorry I made fun of you, Mrs. Mice. Clearly, you know exactly what you're talking about. And you're super cool. Do I have that? Oh, hi, on. I can find out with this. We're learning. Uh, yes, I do have this. This is a tiger butterfly. So I don't need that. Bye. Wow. Unbelievable. The things you learn in Animal Crossing, huh? Can I have one of those? Do I need him? On we go. Where's Tom? I bet he's hanging out with Gwen Stacy. <gasps> Gwen Stacy isn't here either. Check the bridge. She's at the bridge. Oh, there you are. Hello. You chasing butterflies? What the hey? Oh, it's just you. 
That's me. How could you miss me? I'm 600 pines. What do you want? What's up? Don't you think it's stupid that we don't have a movie theater? I thought any of the other villages have one either. It's just stupid. You know, the man makes a good point. Where is your movie theater? I demand movie theater for Animal Crossing. I also demand that the movie theater accommodate people who may or may not be 600 pounds in size and in heart, but mainly size. Because I find it, personally, I find it very difficult to go to the cinema whenever I weigh 600 pounds and it's hard to get inside to the cinema. And it's hard to sit down in the seats in the cinema. Very difficult. So please, in the future, if you guys could fix that, that would be of great importance to me. 19th of April. Okay. And what day is it? The 16th? Let me see. The 15th. I knew that. What do I look like? An idiot? Don't. Don't answer. I don't want to. Oh, it's Spork. Bye. I hope he didn't see me. I ran away from him. Now, people always say to me, how does a guy that weighs 600 pounds move that quickly, that daintily? And I'm like, ballet lessons. That's all it is. I took ballet lessons when I was a young child. And they paid off. I'm lying on my feet. I'm like a cat. Although I'm not like a cat because I walk at two feet and I eat with my finger. Cats don't do that. They just eat with their mouths. I have my eyes on my finger. <laughs> That's why I'm so fat. I have so many mobs. Ten mobs, get out of here. Why does people say that to me? I don't understand. Why do they say you come here often? This is my village. I've been here for 130 days. You keep hanging around like you want to ask me something. So what is it? Uh, other things. What can I do for you? That's pretty funny. Can you come up with that on your own? You said I was such a straight face too. That's why I played along with it. Wh what? 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 What just happened? What? 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 What the hell? Did I miss something? What? What was that? What? What was the thing? Oh, I don't know. I'm so sad. All right, whatever. Let's go put my painting. That I bought with my own money. I didn't steal. That's a mouse. See you. <laughs> Let's put this in my house. So that nobody else can have my painting. It's my painting. I painted it. Not Rembrandt. Not Shim. Not, not him. Not Shim. It was me. Getting it around so people can see it. I want to spin this one around too so people can see it. Spin. Yes. Beautiful. Let me put this right here. Tink, tink, tink. Bump, bump, bump. Wah, wah, wah. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, well, that was fun. Um, I guess that's it. Look at those little wiggles. Look at those little wiggles. The snowman wiggling. That's it for today's episode. Um, if you guys could like subscribe and comment to be able, let me afford my life with suction, that would be very much appreciated. I need to get rid of this weight. I don't know how else to do it. What am I gonna do? I know. I'll get a doctor to cut me open and slurp it out with a hose. That's the best way to do it. Other than that, though, thank you very much for watching. Take it easy. Have a good day, and I hope you. Are a nice man or woman. That's it. See you later.